um, this is just going to be a quick little update. Um, today is the 26th. I got my industrial care on the 17th, in case if you were wondering. And, um, I'm just going to say, out of all the piercings that I have, which is the belly and the cartilage, and I have the belly, that I could describe with all my piercings as, like, a piece or, like, a skin, um, obviously loads are, like, okay, I feel like, yeah, like, <laughs> um, I could describe, like, all my piercings as, like, a pinch or space, but this one? Hell no, sister. <laughs> Um, the next is going to be my tragus, but the top hole hurt a lot, obviously, as I kind of knew that that one would hurt more, but it didn't hurt as much as I was expecting it. I don't know. I expected, like, teeth pain. Like, I cannot handle teeth pain at all. Like, teeth pain is the worst pain, and I was expecting, like, that, so I guess that was a good thing to kind of expect because, um... It wasn't that that bad, but it was, like, pretty bad. And then, like, all I could think of to describe it, just, like, one of the things that, like, pops in your head whenever you have to describe things is, like, someone hammering a nail into your ear. But that's not it at all. That was probably, like, what I was expecting it to be like, but that's really not it. Um... Yeah, but, I mean, obviously everybody's pain is different, but everybody says that it hurts, which it does. But I talked to someone who had her industrial pierce, and she's like, go in there the day you have balls, because it hurts. I didn't really have balls that day. That day was actually kind of a bad day, and I just really wanted my industrial pierce, and it was just everything that was, like, making me happy, like, the past months here. And so I was just like... I don't even care. Just, just freaking pierce me, dude. And he did it, and I was like, oh, oh. he's like, you feel it okay? You feel like you're about to faint or anything? And I was like, no, I'm good. And he's like, I'm gonna do the next one. And I was like, thinking in my head, I was like, wait, can I take like a two more second break? Like, I just need to recover. But he just did the other one, and I was like, screw it, just get it done and over with. Just get all the pain done and over with, because pain is only temporary. That is really what you need to remember whenever you're going and getting a tattoo or a piercing. So just really keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, so there's that. And then I think there was, oh yeah, that facial brush. Um, it has cleared it up some. I mean, obviously I'm still getting some more and I don't know why, but I'm breaking out on my neck. Like the weirdest thing ever. But my boyfriend breaks out in his ears. So I guess that works. But um, <clears throat> yeah, I've been breaking out, um, I'm still breaking out and stuff, but the, I think the, I mean, obviously I think it would work better too if I had acne stuff for my face, but I just don't because my face is so sensitive and I don't know what to use or try. So if you have any suggestions for like sensitive skin and acne stuff, comment down in the below, please. I'm just holding my old industrial barbell and I lost one of the balls. And that is something also you really want to invest in if you have a belly ring or like a piercing like this or whatever because you will lose the freaking balls <laughs> and I've lost three yeah I know where one of them's at one of them's in my boyfriend's grandma's van so yeah but anyways um just a quick little update and stuff um yeah I love you guys see you soon again and have a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, thingamabob. Bye, guys.